Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Frances and I do videos on fashion, lifestyle, nursing school, and parenthood. Okay, so today I'll be sharing with you a nursing school haul. So just a few items or essentials that you may need for nursing school. This is, these are items I particularly need I'm going from tools, instruments that can be purchased in addition to what the school provides you. But luckily I was gifted these items. So a, like a pair of scrubs and uh, instruments that I could use for nursing school and shoes. So shoes are very important. I have two pairs of shoes that I rotate throughout school so far. Um, I do have a previous video on two pairs of nursing shoes that I've worn. Um, I think one of them was like the classic clog ones and then the Nike nursing shoes, which are the most uncomfortable nursing shoes ever. Don't get those. So I do not recommend them. Um, they were comfortable at first, but then actually being in person and clinical and on your feet all day is not the one. It does not have any arch support at all. So anyway, everything that I mentioned in this video today, I will be linking down in the description Box, so don't forget to check that out down below. Let me start by sharing with you the two pairs of shoes that I have been rotating for the last year. So first, they're a little dirty. I do wipe them after every clinical, but these are the cloves. These are in the all white. These are super comfortable. I actually got these in a size six and a half in women's. And so they have laces, but not really. It's like a drawstring type of um, securement, I don't know how to call it, but also it's a little dirty on the bottom, but there's like a little rubber gummy bottom and they're very comfortable. The insert, I, I don't even know how to describe it, but I just feel like, like at first I'm just like, ugh, like these are not that the most attractive shoe, but the support is there for you. Um, very comfortable. I can, I've been wearing them for 12 hour shifts for clinical and even in lecture in theory when I wear it with my uniform. But I highly recommend this, uh, these pairs for sure. They're very comfortable. Um, their slogan, you support them, we support you. So that's perfect. Perfect description for nurses. But anyway, yeah, um, they come in several colors. So you don't have to like, our school requires the all white leather with no laces or, yeah. But these are great. And so the next pair, they're kind of, they're this, I got this pair because they're all white, but they're also very chic, very like Vans looking. So these are the, called the Infinity. And they're pretty much slip-ons. So this is how they look. They're a bit dirty on the bottom. The color is really cute. The little uh, like Tiffany blue. So these are the Infinity by Cherokee. Um, if you are familiar with that brand, I know that brand from like Walmart brands and Target brands, but these are really comfortable too. I've only worn them twice. And for the eight hours that I've worn them at Skills Lab and for Theory in a whole day that I had, they're actually really comfortable, but I do have to break them in still. So they're a bit narrow. Like the toe box is not as wide as the as the cloves, but they're still comfortable and they're oil and slip resistant. Let me show you the toe box on both. If you can see that, the camera catches that. Um, it is slightly bigger on the um, the cloves versus the Infinity Cherokees. So I, I believe that's possibly why it's more comfortable. But also when you look on the bottom, the cloves are a little wider as well. And then so another obviously essential that you need for nursing school is a good quality stethoscope. And this one here is the Littman Classic 3. And I got this one in all black. So this is a classic stethoscope. Here is the box. So these price are, these start at like $139.95. And this is how this one looks. So I got the all black one. So I say all black because this part is lined with black, has the bell side and the diaphragm side. And then even the ear pieces are black. You can see here. 
and they also come with interchangeable um, ear pieces. Not interchangeable, but um, piece, ear pieces that you can change out if you do wear them out. And then a little instruction manual or just how to use. I think I did mention in my previous video of my Bay's expandable backpack what to keep in it. And so this is one of them. This is the um, case that you can put your stethoscope, your reflex hammer, or your pen light in. And so I will link this down below as well, but it holds all your items in here. So I do have a stethoscope from school, but I don't like this one. So that's why I got a new one. And then the inside here stores all your items. I have this reflex hammer that was provided by the school. And then I also keep a pen light. So this pen light is the one where you could um, change the battery, which I like. But other ones that are like cheaper than this, like three bucks, four bucks, you they're like disposable. You kind of have to like throw them out once they die. In my Infinity Cherokee shoe box, I stored a What is this one? The adult size sphygmomanitor. I can't say that word, but sphygmomanitor. So a blood pressure cuff for adult sizes, as well as a pediatric cuff. So obviously the pediatric cuff is smaller, but so this specific brand, which is Prestige Medical, a very well-known nursing medical brand. Uh, comes with a carrying case and then here's the blood pressure cuff itself so this is the smaller band and then this is the manual one I haven't tried it on my daughter yet but this one ranges from 184 to 267 centimeters for the arm uh, circumference all right and then next obviously you're gonna need an ID badge so I got an ID badge with an ID badge holder. This one's the pink heart with the little like EKG on there that a lot of nurses have on their stethoscopes. And then being on our feet all day at work or not whatnot, I got two pairs of standard compression socks. So these ones go up to your calf. There are longer ones that can go like all the way up to above your knee or below your knee or just the ankle ones, but I wanted to get the ones for the calf. Then uh, more instruments. This one is scissors and I got them in pink. So it matches my badge reel. And then I also got a pink reflex hammer as well. If you could see that, I'm not sure because the reflection from the light, but let me take it out of the... This one's pink and black, super cute. I know, super girly. And then the scissors have like a little um, floral print on it. See? Cute. Oh, I forgot to mention also protective eyewear. So I got a pair of these goggles. Cause you never know. Cause you know, like with COVID happening like four years ago, we would always wear like protective um, eyewear. So just to have as backup, I have these two. Now moving on to the scrubs that I got. So yes, I know that Figs is like the number one brand or the Mandela brand I think is the, one of the cheapest brands to purchase on like social media. I haven't tried on Figs personally, but I hear a lot of great things about Figs. I do want to try a pair um, or jacket or so, but I do have those New Balance 327s that they have collabed with. but. I want to give praise to the brand that I'm about to mention now is Healing Hands. So Healing Hands is very great quality. I purchased all these items from a small mom and pop shop. Um, they're called Scrubs For You and I'll go ahead and link them down below so you can go visit, contact them, see what they have in store. They have a lot of variety, a lot of selection and they're priced really well. The management, the owner, she's super sweet, super nice, very helpful. So let me go ahead and start sharing with you the scrubs that I got from this store. I'm gonna start with my navy blue scrub. So this is actually the undershirt that I wear 
to school underneath my uniform. I actually wear navy blue uniform if you if you see it. I'll show a picture here on the screen, but this is because we have only school approved jackets and I haven't purchased one so I'll wear this under my uniform to keep me warm. <clears throat> I wish it was kind of like under armor material where it can absorb your sweat or moisture or whatever but it's not really it's kind of heavy and it's not really breathable. It looks and feels breathable it's soft but when you do really are getting a workout like not wearing it to work out but like you know, lifting a patient or like helping someone and on your feet all day and you're like really warm or sweaty, it doesn't really do that much. It like kind of makes you burn up. But anyway, here's that in a size small. Then I got this scrub top from Healing Hands. This is the purple label. These come with the pockets on the front, like a classic scrub top. This one is in a size small, very soft material. I love it. Then I got the matching jogger pants. So this is the purple label as well. This was the elastic jogger drawstring pants. So I like this because it's drawstring and joggers. So it's kind of fitted and then it gives like a modern look. And I'll go ahead and try these on and do a try on haul at the end of this video. So you see how it looks, but also has a zip closure as the cargo part on the pant as well. Next is the black pair, um, black scrubs that I have. Um, I don't wear black to school, but I feel like these would just be very universal to have if I had a job and if to wear it when I do have a job and if they don't have strict uniform colors. So I pretty much got the same in the navy, in the black as well. So the black drawstring cargos, very cute. You could probably wear it like on your airplane, as an airplane outfit because they're so comfortable. And then this one, I, the scrub top I got are a little different. When I first saw this, it reminded me of um, like a plastic surgeon like on like e-channel just because I always see them wear this type. But this one, these are very comfortable. I like how it opens up the top and it just hangs down, it's not really fitted compared to the uh, navy one. Then I also got an undershirt, under long sleeve too, for Healing Hands brand in black. And then that lastly, a zip up jacket. This one is from the Cherokee Infinity. I got this one as an extra small because it ran really long, but this one's kind of like an anorak type of material, but just to keep me warm. And they do have um, zip pockets as well. That's it for this nursing school essentials haul. I hope you enjoyed what you've seen today. And again, I will link everything down below that was mentioned in this video today so that you can take a look, shop. If you have any questions on how anything fits, um, let me know in the comments down below. And yeah, thank you so much. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.